Hey guys, how's it going? So yeah, this video, I actually wanna talk about my crazy routines. Now I've always had routines for the most part and I've always used these for myself. And I just thought that this time around I would show you guys what I've been doing. So last week I did a detox and I got extremely depressed and I fell out of routine. So usually my brain's working really well. I just know what to do during the day. I know it'd be the most productive. But then like when this happened, when I crashed, I didn't have much of a plan. So the problem was, was with me like doing this was that when, when I got really exhausted and I got really depressed and I started beating myself up, instead of me knowing what to do because my brain was so super foggy, I had no plan. Um, I, I always had like, I have routines and stuff like that. I use like a lot of different stuff. So like I have a shower routine, I have a game routine, I have my, my field report routine, but I didn't really match these up. And number two, I also didn't uh, number them. So like if I don't know what I'm supposed to do in what order, so... Sometimes I go out to go game. However, I also go out to go to the Starbucks and work. But the problem with that is that when I do that, um, I wouldn't know what to do. And then sometimes I sit there, hey man, how's it going? And I wouldn't know what to do. So I would get kind of caught in, um, what's the word? Like um, decision um, bias or whatnot. I didn't know which one to do. So am I supposed to game first or am I supposed to work first? So yeah, so I made my whole self a whole bunch of different routines. Like I've been using routines for a while but I didn't use them to this extent. So I'm gonna show you guys what I've done. I'm gonna show you guys how these all fit together. So I do these all during the week and I do them like, and I schedule them out Monday through Wednesday and then I fit my work in between them. So now this is gonna be the way that I structure my days. So now my days are gonna be really set. So when I get really foggy, if I get tired, I still have my days set and I know what I'm supposed to do. So in the morning, I wake up, I got my water bottles next to my bed. I have my calendar, my notebooks, all the stuff I'm working on, all the mental shit that I'm supposed to be doing early in the day right there so I know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, so first things first, I check my calendar. I check my calendar, I drink my water, so I drink both bottles of water. <laughs> Thanks man, I appreciate you. Um, then I meditate for 10 minutes, then I stretch and I start an educational video, maybe an audible that I really like, maybe something that's really kind of just reading out to me at the moment. Then I move to the shower. So here's my shower routine. <laughs> yeah, it's getting this extensive. Here's my shower routine. So. Um, basically, I build all my habits. So first, if you guys are going to be doing this and you want to do a routine, make you give yourself like cues. So my cues, so my first cue is that I wake up. I look at my calendars. I'm like, oh, shoot. And then I got my water bottles. Make it as easy as humanly possible for me to start doing my little stuff. If you guys want to do routines, make it as easy as humanly possible for you to do this. Now, from here, I have this, my shower routine. Shower routine. I go into my bathroom. First things first, I take my supplements. I take my omega, my omega threes. I take my flaxseed pills. I pop some um, some vitamin D because I'm a pickup artist. I don't usually I day game a lot, but I don't not on the set as much as I should. So I just want to make sure that that's not an issue. Um, brush and then I floss my teeth. Then I sit on the toilet. I again meditate again. This time I only meditate for two minutes, um, but I want to get my energy down. Make sure that I'm really kind of just present. Um, now from here. I jump in the shower and because I looked at my calendar from the morning routine, I know what I'm supposed to be doing throughout the day. So first I visualize my work day, what I was supposed to do through the work day, how would my 10 out of 10 version of myself handle the work day? Number two, how would my 10 out of 10 game version of myself handle today? I visualize myself going out and gaming. I imagine my walk to go out and game, me approaching while I'm out there, it being me being really alive, sitting down, being just zoned in on work. Then once I'm done going and gaming and it being effortless for me to approach, me to be happy, positive, all that kind of stuff, um, being present with the woman, being able to laugh really well, have a lot of fun. Um, then I jump out of the shower, dry off. I go over my game goals, what are my game goals for the day? Uh, I'm not gonna qualify in this way. Today I'm also gonna make myself laugh a lot more, stuff like this. Yeah, <laughs> you'll see, it, this, this gets extensive. Uh, from here, I put on lotion, put on my lotion on, make sure that, you know, keep my skin really you know, moist and, you know, so, supple and whatnot for the older women. <laughs> Throw on my deodorant, now I bounce. Now from here, whoa, I move into my work routine. So work routine, first things first. Um, obviously I gotta get dressed and all that kind of shit. I don't really kick it off. So from here, first things first, I do my breakfast. Breakfast, eggs, make sure I'm eating really clean stuff, maybe an avocado, things like that. Then I prep. Now by prep, what do I mean? Um, Go and grab healthy foods, get some like something that's really nice, maybe a blueberry so that when I go to work, I can sit down and munch on something really good for me. Um, I grab uh, sunscreen. I make sure that I got plenty of water bottles so I don't have to buy anything on the strip. Um, now from here, 
Uh, from here, I start walking. Now, when I walk, plug in my, my headsets, my, my, um, my earbuds, start listening to audibles as I walk. Um, I don't really like listening to music. I used to listen to music, but music gets me in my ego, and ego is bad for game. Um, sometimes, like, the only time I really like playing music is early in the morning if I have a hard time getting myself going. Um, but I don't want to be egotistical. So first things first, I start playing audibles. Audibles are just like a really good thing. I don't really have to focus on them too much. Like if I forget something or hear something's really dope, I, I rewind it. But generally that's what I do. And then on my walk too, I make sure that I'm approaching and I'm being open to the mind that I'm approaching. Before I get to work, I want to at least approach one or two sets. Um, from here, I get to Starbucks, coffee, water, pull out my healthy food, get my laptop out, get all my notes together, start working. Now from here, handle emails, handle students, handle all that kind of stuff. Look at content, what's the content I'm working on? Can I edit videos? Can I work on the content of a video? Then how can I make money? How am I gonna make money today? Make sure that I don't go broke and uh, homeless. Um, then I work on any other extracurricular things that run on my planner, any things that need to be done, like maybe like DMV stuff or you know handling pay, uh, bills, all that kind of shit. Um, from here, now I'm starting to transition to the game. All right, so what do I do? Go over my canned lines, look at my prior field reports from the day previous, and then I go in game. Now from here, well, actually, I don't have my game uh, schedule here, but I already know what it is. Um, set my alarm for how long it's supposed to go out. Not allowed to look at my phone unless I'm putting phone numbers in there, stuff like that. Um, and I just go and approach. I think positively. I go through my usual like way of getting myself in my zone. And if it's a if it's Monday through Wednesday, I go out and I game for three hours. If it's Thursday through Sunday, I go out and game for six hours. All right. Now from here, if it's Monday through Wednesday, if I'm only gaming for three hours, I go back to my place. Um, and then I do this. So my after game schedule. So here, after game schedule. Um, so first, number one, if I feel like it, I'll chill for a second, maybe relax, get myself kind of a moment to breathe. Two, um, I plan videos, I shoot videos, and I edit videos. So Monday through Wednesday are my days to do this, so I can game more of the better weeks, days of the week. Um, but Monday through Wednesday are kind of my days to really just knock out a fuck ton of work. So if I'm only doing that. Monday through Wednesday, then I, I work until I need to, until I get everything done. I shoot all my videos for Girls Chase. I shoot all my videos for me, plan all my videos, get all my stuff done, get my videos for my success channel, for my uh, for my pickup channel, all that kind of shit, make sure that everything's on point. Um, yeah, things like that. Now, from here, um, let's say that, like, so let's say I got to go out and game, get the same exact schedule, get myself prepared for game, same way I did I do it before, go to my can lines, look at my field reports from the day before, then from there I relax and I just kind of, you know, get myself in the zone. Then I just baby step myself out and I go and force myself to go game sometimes. Uh, most of the time it's easy nowadays. Now here. Now at the end of the night, here's my final routine that I got going. So my night routine. So the night routine has to prepare the day for the day before and also has to make my future days better. So this is how I do my night routine. Okay. So firstly, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fucking A. I'm, I'm such a fucking freak. Jesus Christ. Okay, so <laughs> number one, the thing that starts off the night routine is that, okay, well, I gotta start getting tired. I'm starting to get tired. Okay, cool. Brush and shower. So I brush my teeth, floss, shower, and then when I do my shower, I also jump to my shower routine again. So I redo my shower routine again, minus the, the supplements. Um, minus anything else? Yeah, I don't do the 10 out of 10 at night. Actually, I should though. I should do my 10 out of 10 at night. Uh, it'd probably be good to do my 10 out of 10 to see how uh, my 10 out of 10 version compared to my day self. So maybe I should start doing that. Um, yeah. Um, I definitely do meditate though. Meditation like right before, like for my shower routine, I do that every time. Um, I only do it for two minutes though for that um, because I'm still trying to make it a habit. And whenever you're trying to make a habit, you just want to build firstly the habit of showing up to a habit. So even if it's like something really simple, like same way that if you want to go and game every day, sometimes it's just easy enough just to get yourself showing up. Um, it's the same thing with meditation. I do the same exact thing. Um, so from here, night routine, I get through my shower routine. Then two, get by my bed. I plug my phone into the charger, plug my headsets into my charger so the next day it's fully charged. Three, open up my calendars and my notebooks and I set them right next to me so the next morning I don't have to open them and it's as little steps between me and doing what I'm supposed to do as possible. So that if I wake up and I'm in a low state, it's like all I have to do is just turn my head and I can read it instead of having to pull it out of my backpack. Instead, they're all laid out, they're there, and they're perfectly set for me to do. Um, now, from here, set a couple of bottles of water out. I visualize 10 out of 10 waves of sleeping. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> um, set my bottles of water out so then the morning so I can chug my bottles of water so I can so my morning routine's on work is on fleek. 
and I'm not having issues with that. So that, um, again, so if I wake up and I'm a low state, it's, uh, <laughs> so if I wake up and I'm still in a low state, um, I don't have to go all the way to the fridge. Instead, I'm a water bottle right next to me. I can pound them both back. Um, from here, I audit my day. So this is something that most people don't do, and I think more people need to do. Pull out my calendar, look through it, and I'm like, did I actually do everything I was supposed to do in my day? So this is the same thing I'll do if I don't approach a girl. Um, what was the reason I didn't approach that girl? How can I prevent my future self from never having that be the reason for me not approaching a girl again? That's one way of doing it. Now, with the auditing the calendar, let's say that I fuck up on something. Why did I fuck up and miss that? Oh, I forgot. Well, you know what? You know what I do whenever I forget stuff? I fucking, here, actually, I'm gonna show you guys. So, like, for like this. Uh, before sleep, watch infield. So now I have no choice but to see that. Now, for another example. <laughs> so my ADHD ass doesn't ever forget. Put all of them right here. There's no way of me ever forgetting. Um, what else is another way that I remember? I put post-it stamps everywhere. Like on the back of my laptop, I also have um, right field reports and I set it right next to my bed. So whenever it comes down to it and um, whenever it comes down to it and I forget, it's right on top of my couch. So I set my laptop on my couch right before I leave for game and it says, write down field reports. So when I walk in the house and I'm about to grab my laptop, or like, let's say, not even grab my laptop, let's say that um, I pull out my laptop and it says write field reports. I'm like, oh yeah, that's right. It says write a field report. And then it just reminds me. Now, uh, after game, watch uh, videos, fill out spreadsheets. So basically fill out my field reports. I put them here too. I just put so many reminders everywhere. I have no choice, but remember, essentially, if that makes any sense for you guys. Oh, and if there's no fucking way that I'm going to forget this shit, it's all the fuck over my wall, like everything. Like there's my curriculum. Here's the stuff I'm working on. Here's my stuff for business. Here's my mental stuff right here. And here's some more mental stuff that I'm working on. Like there's no chance of me forgetting this shit. Like my ADHD is not going to fucking get the better of me. Like I'm going to fucking figure this shit out. Um, now let's say it's not something like for me forgetting. Let's say it's just me being tired. Okay, well, how can I prevent my tired self from stopping me from working? Make, again, it as easy as possible for me to, like, fit, figure all this shit out. So what do I do? I set water bottles next to my bed. So if, like, low, low, um, low vibration self is in, um, is in the forefront when I wake up, he has no choice but to do it. Or not even no choice, but it's just so easy for him to do. Why wouldn't he do it? Like, it's in his best interest, and it's so easy. Um, it, like, or, like, um, let's say that I don't want to go in game. I just baby step myself into going out. Baby step, and I, I walk my way into going out. I don't want to go, ah, oh, so tough. Uh. All right, cool. Well, I'm going to listen to music. Walk my way out the door. It's just the music, bumping music. Like, thinking about how fun it's going to be. Then once I'm out walking, um, I see one cute girl. I'm like, oh, shoot, that was a cute girl. I could have talked to her. All right, well, next one. And then the next girl comes around to approach her, and now I'm out gaming. Like, find ways to trick yourself. So, like, that's when it comes down to auditing your, your day. The reason that I do all this shit is because I audited my day, like, again and again and again. And I figured all this shit out. So when it came down to it, now I have no choice but to do it because I figured out my, my brain and how I work because I audit my days. So right here, again, this is, this is the right one, yeah. So number three in this list is audit my days. And I also do this on Sundays where I audit my entire week. So Sundays are my day to audit my week and look through my calendar and make sure I did everything right. Mm -hmm. From here, I take my supplements and I watch infields. So I watch infields of the greats and I want to see how my game compares up to theirs and I try to pull shit from the, what they're thinking. So I have a whole bunch of lists and like private infields that I have downloaded on my laptop. I go through them all, I watch them. Um, I try to like kind of get in the mindsets of the guys that I'm watching. I'm like, okay, why did he do that? Okay, I like the way they said that. I'm gonna start saying it like that. Oh, I like the way that he thinks about this or I like the way they flip the way the girl says this. And that, this is also why too, I'm also really good at breaking down infields because I do this all the fucking time. I'm also really good at game. Like, I'm really fucking, like, I'm, I'm gnarly. All right, I'm not one of these fucking, like, you know, weak faggots who's like, you know, is a numbers game? Yeah, no, I fucking figure this shit out. <laughs> All right, from here, um, now I, I took my pills for sleep, so I took my melanin pills, make sure I knock out again. Like, get go to bed early, too. If you guys want to wake up early, you got to go to bed early. You need sleep. Sleep is so vital to being, like, really fucking awake. Um, from here... When I close my eyes, that's my cue to visualize. So I visualize game until I fall asleep. So then I start dreaming about game and shit, which is also another little weird thing that I started doing. But yeah, again, now this, like again, if you guys were here since the beginning, that all comes right back to the morning routine. The night routine builds back into the morning routine. I wake up, I check my calendar because the night routine, I set it next to my bed. Um, I drink H2O. 
Again, I set it next to my bed in my night routine. Um, yeah, it's just, it all plays into each other. Like this, these like, so if I ever get tired and I ever get brain foggy or my low state self is like, I'm going to take over for a few days. He has no choice, but like, I make it so easy for him to like fucking follow this shit. Like if low state me comes to the forefront and he's like, I don't want to do it. It's like, he just has to roll over, grab the water bottles I set out for him. Or, um, yeah, like this is how you guys need to set up your life. <laughs> yeah. So like, this is like, as you guys can see, this is a lot of trial and error. This wasn't, it's not like a bunch of read a bunch of this shit. Um, it's a bunch of nerdy stuff. It's for me like, like overthinking the fuck out of my entire life and how I think. And basically I, I'm like, I'm like a rat in a maze or like, um, you know, like how they like, they'll like give like shocks to like a rat or like they'll, they'll be like, oh, when we do this, like the simple creature does this. Like I'm kind of just breaking myself down into a simple creature and I'm like, okay, when every time that I fuck up, I audit my days and I get a little bit closer to what a more of a, like a more... What's the word? It's just an intelligent way to break down your day. So for you, you guys, um, you guys don't have to do all this at once. I, I kind of worked my way up to this. Like I start off with my shower routines. My shower routines were where this was at. Also my game routines. Um, I also kind of, and then for over the course of like years, I've been auditing my days to the point to where now, like I just know how I work and I know how I'm gonna think and I know how I'll react to a certain situation. So I force myself into a corner to do what I know is best for me to do, even when I don't want to do it. So when like right now I'm in high state me, you guys hear how fucking intelligent I sound right now and, I'm, and I know exactly what I'm talking about, it's because I'm in high state me. I'm, my brain's just fucking whirring up. I've been gaming all day and I'm just, my brain's just on fire. So now, because I'm like this, now I can set all this shit up, make it as easy as possible. So you know what I'm gonna do with all these things, all my routines? I'm gonna set them all up on the wall and I'm also gonna put multiple reminders. So put them all up on the wall in my hallway and then wherever I'm supposed to be like, so like the, um, the shower routine, I'll make another shower routine poster and I'll put it in my bathroom or like I'll put them next to my post-it stands be like one, two, three, number them so I know which one's supposed to do in order. Now this is like really fucking like out there kind of shit too. Like, I don't know, like most people who, I don't know I've ever heard anybody explain how they do this like I do. Like this is kind of a little bit weird. Like, I don't know anybody who has like fucking like six routines that they do throughout the day. But yeah, if you guys have any questions, yeah, let me know. I'm actually here. What are you guys saying? Sorry, I've been like talking this entire time. Yeah, I just don't do cold showers. I probably could add them, but I don't see the value in it. And like for me to do something, I have to see the value in doing it. If I don't have the lock in, like I, like I have lock into all this. This shit's easy for me to do. But for cold showers, I don't really see the benefit as of yet. Maybe it's like for waking up and like getting me more awake, but I'm already pretty awake when I get to this point. Um, do you have afternoon routines? My afternoon routines are kind of like, I'm basically gaming all afternoon. So I game three to six hours a day, plus like me gaming at night. So I'm basically gaming all afternoon. So I don't really have too much of an afternoon routine except for Monday through Wednesday. So mo Monday through Wednesday, I game three hours. So like I said back here, um, this is my Monday through Wednesday routine. So um, after game, I so once I'm done with game, I get back home, I instantly write a field report. Sometimes I'll chill out for a little bit. But then once I'm done chilling, plan videos, shoot videos, edit videos. I do this Monday through Wednesday. So those that's my afternoon routine. But generally afternoons, I'm just gaming all day. So I just do that nonstop. Um, if you, you know, I go pretty hard in this shit. I'm not like some guy who just like claims to game online or some shit. This is really something new that I'm doing. I mean, I've done routines before, but I've never routine stacked like this. Like this is like, this is some weird game shit that some like freak like me would come up with. But yeah, let me know if you guys think. Okay? No Alright guys, peace out. False with the dialogue, modest with depression. Honorably discharged, admired as a veteran. Regardless of anything you've heard, he's absolutely fascinated by your choice of words. And he is what lives in our shadows. A voice that we hear that communicates in vowels. Pressed to the window with an eye on discovery. Destined to imitate a butterfly that's fluttering. Co